and Pandel. Yes. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> when did you have time to cook all this? You must have woken up very early. Don't worry. Sweetheart, I'm always here for you. Okay? I got you. <laughs> I'm running late for school. Oh, uh, shut them out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's eat up mm -hmm. so we can go to school. Eat I can, up, eat up. We can get out of here. Gobble up, gobble up. You have to eat faster. Uh, yes, because you're the one who's running late. So eat up. <laughs> Oh man, I'm full, bro. I know. Ah, this is her uh, overfeeding. Uh, I overfed myself. Really? Lunch was tasty, bro. <laughs> ah, it was. You know that's my favorite food. Oh yeah, I told you. Of course I know. Now I'm gonna get favorite food now. <laughs> People like me, huh? Would they chop anything? I know. Drink anything, joy. I'm the most serious about. Your wife is a good cook. I, know. I really enjoyed lunch. And she's a fantastic cook. Yes, she's a fantastic cook. I'm, I'm, I'm actually not happy that you came and shot in my ration. Ah, ah. How did you know I was having lunch? I sniffed it. Ah, your nose, this guy. Be like dog nose. Better than that of a dog. Ah, you know, I was just there opening it, relishing the uh, aroma, mm. getting ready to eat, feeling like, oh, I just next thing. Yeah, man, what's that? Look who's walking in. Two seconds later. Ah, ah, die right oh, on time. Normal level. Oh boy. <laughs> ah! Little chick. Uh, I, I, I don't think she put two people. Mm. I don't know. Never mind. I'll use my tongue. <laughs> At least the taste will last longer in your mouth. <laughs> Bro. I swear. When I'm ready to get married. I will search. I will search all nook and cranny. I will make sure I find a woman that can cook. Don't take chances on me, foodie. Of course. Uh -huh. oh, but you need to. You better. You see what I did, right? That's the reason I went for a home trained lady all the way from my village. Mm. That's yeah, go home, find a lady that's find a lady that is well trained. In, in, in all these things, you know, domestic, she can cook and... Because, you see the city girls of these days, they won't do it all. Mm -hmm. They'll tell you they can't stand the heat of the kitchen. Oh, There's I nothing know. you can do about it. Now I know why you said village girls are the best. You get it, you know? Ah. You get it? Ah. Shine your eye, bro. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to my village in search of one. No, no, no. Come to my village. Mm. There are plenty. Oh, really? I'm telling you. Beautiful girls that are well trained. So what are we doing? Come on. Don't worry. We will go. <laughs> we will go. Christmas. <laughs> eh? uh, Christmas at my village. How about that? Are you tired? You're tired, eh? Oh, okay. Let me come, come. Let's let's go to bed. Let me take you to bed, okay? Hmm. Don't worry. You we'll see, Daddy tomorrow when he's back or when he comes back. Hmm? Let's go. So late. 
Everything okay? It's traffic. Oh, traffic. <clears throat> oh wow. Oh, traffic. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. Ada was waiting up for you. There was this particular assignment she wanted you to do for her. You should have helped her with it. That one. She wanted you. She insisted it was you who did it for her. Okay, well, that'll have to be tomorrow because I'm really exhausted right now. I can tell. Anyways, let me get your food, right? While you're freshen up, right? Yeah. All right. Okay. I'm off to the kitchen. <laughs> All right, baby. Okay. I've been looking forward to getting home to eat your food. I know. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Can't do this. Why are you always tired, though? <laughs> because I work so hard and then I have to struggle through the traffic. I come home so tired. <sighs> Maybe tomorrow. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Be a married man, but you belong to me and I belong to you. Oh my okay? <laughs> and you understand that you are the source of my happiness. Excuse me. Are you sick or something? What's wrong with you? Now listen to me. Let this be the last time you go fighting my boyfriend. I won't take it from you. What is all this nonsense? No, what is all this? I know you feel like you need to say this, but I'm not going to stand by and let him keep you from being able to fight. Okay? Okay, you want to do this now? Is this how you want to do it? Get out of my house. Get out of my house. I understand that you're upset, so I'll go. I'll come back when you feel better. Get out! I love you. Don't make me push. Don't. Get out. I love you. Please, can you just go? You're beginning to irritate me. Confused man. Your man, you don't want me to get to try the relationship. You're going to confront my boyfriend. He's the gods for me. I have you. You just try the nonsense with me again. You bitch. 
much. Michael. Michael! What is happening to you? It's as if you're not interested in this. Remember, we have a meeting tomorrow, first thing tomorrow morning, and you're supposed to make the presentation. What is wrong with you? Um, I'm sorry, bro. You know what? Why don't you just make the presentation tomorrow? You know everything about the business already. You know what you want to do. So just go ahead and do it yourself. You don't need to give me all the details. You can handle it. Are you okay? Talk to me. I'm not okay, bro. I'm not. What is it? Brother, and another man is about to take my woman from me. What? You mean your wife? Is she cheating on you? Hey, come on, stop being ridiculous. I'm not talking about my wife. Hell no. Bella, my girlfriend. Another man is about to take her away from me. <laughs> Wait a minute. Don't tell me you're looking this way because of a side chick or what. Then what will happen if it's your wife? Huh? Then what will happen if it's your wife? Oh my goodness. Sometimes I ask myself, what do men really want in this life? Come on, James. You're not about to give me a lecture right now, are you? Like right now? Bro, you just, you just can't understand. Maybe that's why you're still single. How can you say, uh, 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 what, what, what does a man want? What does a man want? What do I have? What do I really have? So you think all that's important is knowing how to cook and knowing how to uh, uh, clean the house, being domestic and all that. As a man, you should know that there are things that are, there are things that are more important, you know? The way a woman will handle you and you, you feel yourself as a man, you know, you feel, you feel alive and that's what this girl gives to me like i feel like a man when i'm with her and <sighs> michael i'm not i'm not trying to lecture you okay i'm just trying to remind you that you have a wife that doesn't stress you god has blessed you with a very good and loyal woman for a wife I would advise you stick to her and forget everything that has to do with this side distractions. Please. James, you just won't understand. No matter how much I try to explain it to you. You, you, you are one kind of person, no? Are you not a man? Why is it so difficult for you to understand what I'm saying? Anyway. Let's just get back to work because you're not, you're not, I'm not feeling your vibe. No, no. There's no getting back to any work here, okay? I've gone too far to realize that you have not been listening to me. If I knew, I wouldn't have disturbed myself. I would have stopped. Anyway, there you go. Study this. Tomorrow, you're making the presentation. I'm going to my office. I was listening. Uh, come on, I don't care if you're listening or not. Just study this, okay? Please, study the document. No, of course, no, I'm just distracted. Just go through it, okay? Bro, just... Okay, sorry.
here again. Huh? I mean, why do you, why do you feel like you can invade my privacy? Or you have a special place in my life? Why do you feel so? It's all right, Bella, please. What do you want? Just tell me what you want. You want to know what I want? Yes. I want to be married. I want my own man. I do not want to share my man with another woman. That is exactly what I want. Please, sit down. Listen, baby, you're the only reason I'm still in that marriage to that woman. If you leave me, things are really going to go wrong for me. How do you mean? Look, let's just say you're my source of happiness. I enjoy being with you. I enjoy your company. I enjoy making love to you. I enjoy going out with you. I enjoy spending time with you. And I don't want to lose that. Mm. Okay. If you want me to leave Damien, then you must marry me. Mm -hmm. And need I remind you that I do not share my man. So that means your wife has to go for me to come in. Are we good? Marriage is what you want? Mm -hmm. Your wife must leave for me to come in. If you're good, I'm good. Are you sure you're okay? I'm very okay, bro. Very okay. You see, let me get something straight. Let me understand something, please. Are you planning to get married to two women? Or you want to choose your side chick over your wife? No matter how many times I try to make you understand, you can't understand. And I don't blame you. You can't understand because, James, you're not the one in my shoes. You're not the one who is, who is enjoying this thing. Because if you get just one chance with Bella, just one chance, bro, you forget yourself. You will forget yourself. I don't think I can ever find another woman that's as sweet as Bella, that makes me as happy as her. And I'm, I'm not going to risk losing her. I'm not willing to, I'm not going to. My girl, I can see you're obsessed. You're joking, right? I just hope you come back to your senses. No jokes, bro. Seriously. I'm not going to risk losing that girl. I'll give up everything for her. Yes. I'll break ties with anyone who tries to come between us. Even you. <laughs> no need to talk again. Now I know the devil is manipulating you. <laughs> Michael, the devil is tempting you. And see, you are going to use your own hands to mess things up for yourself. I'm telling you. The devil is using that girl on you, Michael. Open your eyes and see. Ah, come on, come off it. Pastor James, don't preach to me, I don't need it. The devil can never create something as sweet as Bella. Huh? That's sweet in the middle. And if at all, that is what it means to be used by the devil, then let the devil use me. Let the devil use me, yes. I'm not Pastor James, okay? As your friend, I'm only telling you the bitter truth. Mike, be careful. On a more serious note, be careful. 
Be careful of what? You're forgetting that I'm the one who went to this girl. She did. She didn't come to me. I went to her. So why are you making it look like there's some huge conspiracy? Dude, I found someone who makes me happy and I've made my choice. I've made my choice, so I don't know what. Or there's nothing you can say that will change any of this. Say so. The devil doesn't give sweet things for nothing. The devil offers you a sweet thing. But behind it, there are lots of bitter things that goes with I it. I just told you to stop preaching. Don't preach to me. No problem. Let's keep preaching to yourself. Let's go back to what we're talking about. I was just trying to tell you something that's happening. And yes. yeah, okay. I didn't expect no. you. Um, I'll be there in about 20 minutes. Yeah, I'm about to leave the house now. Yeah, 20 minutes. Hi, baby. Hey, baby. What's good? Hmm? Are you going out? Ah, uh, yes, yes. But you just got back from work. I, I thought you would have been resting. Um, there's this important meeting I need to attend. Do you need anything from outside? Okay. Um, not exactly. Yes, actually. Uh, I need to stock up the house because we are gradually running out of food stuff. Oh, well, that's not something I can attend to right now. So perhaps tomorrow? Okay. Just manage what we have at home. Yeah, sure. Why not? I'll uh, do just that. Okay. If you're going, you need to go now because it's getting late. Sure. Right? Okay. Be careful. Yeah. Hello. Hi, Mr. James. Ah, uh, sorry to bother you by this time. Um, it, it's about Michael. I don't know if he's with you because I've been trying to reach him and he's not picking my call. So I, I, I've been wondering. I, I mean, it's it's late, you know. He's with you. Okay, 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 all right. It's past midnight now, you should have been home by now. Thank you. 
everything okay? Are you okay? Is everything all right? I sent you a message that I wasn't coming home. Yes, you did, but that was unusual. I was still worried. You weren't even taking my calls. <sighs> Look, the traffic was very bad. It got very late. I couldn't come home. Uh, why were you worried? I told you I wasn't coming home. I'm still worried now. Shouldn't I be worried? It's not like it's not like you. I don't have any other explanation. Okay. I'm getting late for work. I need to go get ready. Babes, I just finished dressing Ada for school, so she's waiting for you to take her. Well, as you can see, I'm not quite done with what I'm doing, and I need to tidy this up before I leave. So please take her to school yourself. Okay. Um, please, can you give me some money so I can buy some things while coming back? I need to, you know. I'm sorry, I, I don't have any money. I can't attend to that right now. Anything concerning money, please. Just, but, you know, I, I said there's no money. What, 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 what bots? You're getting on my last nerves. Though. I just told you there's no money. What, what bots? I'm sorry. But what? I'm sorry. Manage what we have at home. Don't, don't, okay. don't bother me. Don't do business with some serious minded people. I'm sorry I'm late for the meeting. I'm really sorry. Oh God! What's wrong with you? By the way, where did you spend the night? What do you mean? Your wife. Your wife called me. And all efforts I put to get to you was wasted. You only taking your calls? How do we get our clients back? How do we get our clients back? You're asking me. A meeting is fixed for today in your office and you're coming two hours late and you're asking how do we get them back? I already said I'm sorry, okay? This has never happened before, has it? It hasn't happened because it's not supposed to happen. And you're not supposed to let it happen. What is wrong with you, bro? I already said I'm sorry. What else do you want me to say? You're sorry. I'm sorry. You know what? Leave it. Huh. Dude, whatever I have with Bella is my business and nobody else's. The fact that I related with you once in a while doesn't give you any right to interfere. I'm sure she told you what happened yesterday. Whether you like her or not is your business. What's important is that I like her and I want to be with her. That's it. Michael, listen to yourself. Just listen to yourself. I'm your friend. What I'm trying to do is to watch your back. I mean, be there for you as a brother. But since you don't appreciate it, okay, let it be. Okay? Thank you. You're going to stay out of my business, right? Because I very much appreciate that. It's okay, I will leave. But please, do not run back to when your actions backfire. I won't. Thank you.
Baby, I am glad you were able to put him in his place. Anything for you, my love. I will not tolerate the fact that he hates you for no reason. Why? Hmm. Look, I'm willing to discard with anyone for you. I just want to live my life happily with you. My love, I am ready to move in this weekend. But I hope she won't be there. Hmm? Babe, whenever you're ready to move in, just move in. The house is free for you, okay? I love you. <laughs> um there's something I've been meaning to talk to you about. Okay, what is it? No, no, it's okay. You can just sit there, you'll hear me. Okay. What is it? I want you and Ada to relocate to the village. You want me and Ada to relocate to the village? Why? Why are we relocating to the village? No, if we relocate to the village, what will happen to her school? Why are we even relocating to the village? Is there a problem? I want to take a second wife. And I don't think she'll be comfortable with both of you in the same house with her. She want to what? What's, what's going on? Uh, baby, wait, hold on. It, sweetheart, sweetheart, is everything okay? Can you hear yourself? What are you talking about? I'm fine. So, wait. When did this start? Where is this coming from? You've been cheating on me? Excuse me? I have every right to. And if you're not cool with it, you can leave. come over you because I'm trying to understand why you would just wake up one morning and then decide for me what to do asking me to go back to the village with my child our child then if I'm not cool with it I what are you talking about Michael please you can talk to me what is going on look you can make of it whatever you want my decision is made and there's no going back no Am I missing something? What just happened right now? Am I missing something? Uh, am I dreaming? No, I must, I must be dreaming. Am I dreaming? What, what's going on? I left money in that locker for you and my daughter's transport to the village. Come on now. Are you still on this? Stop it. Please just stop it, okay? You can't just ask me to leave our home because of another woman. Come on, Michael. Come on. If it's a joke, just stop it. Amanda. Look me in the eyes and tell me that you really think I'm joking. Does this face look like the face of a man who is joking with his life? Huh? I told you, I'm no longer interested in you. I'm no longer interested in this marriage. I've fallen out of love with you. I don't have feelings for you anymore. I want to move on with my life, with someone else. And you're here, you think I'm joking? Why would I joke with a thing like that? 
Look, I want you and Ada to go to the village. I came up with that solution because I know you don't have any place else to go to. That's the best place for you to go to. So I can keep taking care of you while you are there. But for this, as for this house, I need space. I need space here. Do you understand it? Michael, even at that, I should be able to decide for myself. Decide for yourself. Fine, but not for me. I just told you what my decision is for myself. Do you understand? I don't know what the argument is all about. Do I look like I'm joking? Do I really look like I'm joking to you? I don't want to see you in this house when I get back. What has come over my husband? Is he under his spell? Because I don't understand this. What is wrong with him? God. Is this serious? Hi, James. Thank you so much for all your efforts. God bless you. Thank you. This is how I'm going to lose my marriage. Is this how I'm going to lose my home? No. Please, I don't know what else to do. <sighs> this is quite unfortunate. Honestly, I don't know what has come over my kill. Truth be told, I'm aware of everything that is happening. Initially, I thought he was joking. I never knew it was so serious. I've begged him, James. I have begged him. But I don't know again. I don't have anywhere to go, James. I don't have. I can't go back to the village. If my mother sees me in the village, I don't know what she will say. I don't know what people will say. I'm not ready to leave my marriage. I can't quit my marriage. James, I still love Michael. I love him. I don't know how to do without him. I don't know how I can live without him. Please help me talk to him. Help me beg him, please. Please do not worry. You have to calm down. Okay. You have to be strong. If not for anyone, for your daughter's sake, be strong. Okay. I don't know. I just hope this whole thing. I don't know, because I'm tired. I'm tired now. I'm tired of the, the, the situation, the whole sudden change. I just hope it is. I understand your pains, I do. Amanda, you have to be prayerful. And hopeful too. Thank you so much, James. Thank you. I'll go back to the house. She'll be going back to the house. Now. It's okay. Mm -hmm. I'll leave for the office from here. And I'll try to talk to him again. Okay. I promise you that I will. Okay, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Please be careful, okay? Yes. Be careful. <laughs> Bro. If you want to be a polygamist, so why don't you get married to two women? Hmm? Because I'm wondering. 
I thought all this while you just joking. I never knew you were serious. Come to think of it. Have you ever thought about your little girl? Your daughter? What this separation will do to her? Come on, James. Ada will be fine. Okay? There are plenty of people who grew up without parents. And they're doing fine. I haven't said I'm abandoning them. I told her that I'll continue to provide for Ada. And her, I will visit them. I didn't say I'm, I'm, I'm no longer her father. I just want her to go to the village so I can have some space to myself. And this is the reason why I want her to go. So she'll stop going about looking for who will come and beg me to change my mind. That's not going to happen. My friend, I can see you've lost it. I've not lost anything. James, if you came for us to discuss business, let's talk business. If not, please, you can leave so I can get back to work. I have a lot on my table. Michael, I'm your friend. I'm like a brother to you. So I'm in the position to tell you the truth no matter what. Okay? I just hope you don't regret this because this is not the best of idea. It's either Bella or nothing. You understand that? my love you're still here I thought I told you I didn't want to see you here when I got back I'm sorry I cannot leave my marriage my mother will die of heart attack if she sees me return home so I'm not leaving my marriage oh that's what you're going to say mm. I see that's what you're saying I can't Oh, okay, you're going to blackmail me. You're going to blackmail me into staying in a marriage that I don't want anymore because you're telling me you're... Okay, you think I'm joking, right? You think I'm joking? I've told you that my woman doesn't want to see you here. You think I'm joking? Don't worry. of this what do you mean what's the meaning of this did i not tell you i don't want to come back and see you in this house huh you're leaving my house do you understand that you are leaving my house it's as simple as that michael michael please please you can't do this to me now you, please you can't cause me all this shame i would i don't know how to explain myself i don't know how to say that my marriage could not work michael please i don't care okay i don't care I don't care what anybody thinks. I want to be happy. I deserve to be happy. Have I not tried? Have I not given you enough time? Oh my God, please. This marriage means a lot to me. 
Please, I, I wouldn't know what to say to anybody that happened. Please, Michael, please. I just told you I don't care about that. I don't care. Look, I've, I've, I've tried. I have tried for several years now. All you know how to do is cook. But there are other things that a man needs. Other needs that, that must be fulfilled. And I have tried to teach you. I have tried my best for years now, but you are not changing. And I'm tired of feeling like I'm sleeping with a log of wood. Okay? I found someone who can meet all my needs. She makes me happy. I want to continue my life with her. Please. Michael, please. Please, I'm begging you. Please, I'm begging you. Okay? Okay, okay, fine. Fine. She can... She can't come, please, but just let me stay. I, I, I know your new woman will need help. Let me stay and, and keep the house. Please, you know I don't have anywhere to go, Michael, please. I can stay and help. I can help the house. I, I can cook. I can clean. Just at least stay here. Please, Michael. Please. Well, that's not something I can decide on alone. I'll have to talk to her. If she's fine with it, you're in luck. If she's not, I'm sorry, you have to go. Meanwhile, please, take your things to the guest room. All of them. Take everything, because I need to prepare this place for her. She's coming, and I want her to be comfortable. Okay. Thank you for letting don't, me stay. Don't thank me. Don't thank me for anything. I haven't said you can stay. Okay? She will decide that. I beg you in God's name, forgive me. Whatever it is I've done wrong, however I've offended you, please forgive me. Don't bring shame to me. Don't bring me dishonor, please, Michael, please. Amanda, is it, is, is it by force? Is it by force? I said I'm no longer interested in the marriage. I need you to go, I need you to leave. It's as simple as that. Michael, whatever I did, whatever it is at all, I can make amends. I promise you, I will do right by this you. This is not about what you've done or not done, okay? I, I just want to... I want to move into the next phase of my life with another person. Is that too much to ask? Okay. You can marry another woman. But please, let me stay. Please, let me stay. I, I can't... Uh, you're not understanding the simple situation. It's a simple situation. There is no space for you here anymore. Okay? There is no space for you here. You need to leave. Okay? It's a simple thing. Don't make it hard for yourself. Michael, please. You don't expect it to be easy for me. I'll just wake up one morning and then my husband is not there. He just decides to discard me like a tissue paper. Michael, it, it, won't, it can't be easy. Michael, please. Amanda, I need you to take Ada and go to the village. It's as simple as that. I will send money for her upkeep. I will send money to you. I'll come and visit once in a while. That's the best I can offer. Okay? I found another woman I'm in love with and I want to move on with her. Michael, please. Oh, Michael, please don't do this don't. to me. If not for my sake, please, for the sake of our daughter, please. Don't bring our daughter into the... Why is mommy crying? Michael, please, look at us. Michael, please, don't do this to us. Michael, please. Don't make me repeat Michael, myself. Michael, please, don't do this to don't me. me. Michael, Michael. Michael, please, Michael. Michael! Michael! Yeah. Uh. 
No! My God, please! Ada, please go to your room. Now, please, go. Ada, you're not going to greet my guest? Good afternoon, Ma. Um... So, here we are, baby. Can you show me to the room? Uh, we will go to the room, but let me show you around the house first. Okay. 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 <laughs> are you just going to stand there or are you going to help her take the bags to the room? Is she dumb, deaf, or...? No, no, don't bother with her, okay? Come on, she's, she's just slow sometimes. When you are done, hello, when you are done, I want to see you. Show me around, baby. Show me. Oh, what is this? So, wow. There you are. What do you think about your new home? And of that, <laughs> my new home, though it needs a feminine touch, you know, it's so dull in here. Oh, really? Ew. But not to worry, I'm here. <laughs> okay, just do what you must with it. It's yours. It's no. <laughs> do with it whatever you want. It's your space now. No problem. <laughs> Sorry, um, sorry. Oh, welcome. You don't know how to knock. Do you have a window in your hand? No, I knocked. Maybe you didn't hear. Then welcome. Whatever. Come this way. You sent for me. I did. I sent for you. Do you want to beat me? <laughs> um, listen. Um... You'll be doing my laundry later in the day. But before then, I'd like you to make dinner for my baby and I. And from tomorrow, I'll make you a menu. I'll make you a menu. And then I'll paste it in the kitchen so that you can know what to cook at intervals. Am I understood? Okay, ma. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I don't like to stress myself. This woman is going to stress me. Oh, you don't have to do it so well. Though. I know, my baby. Come on. Baby. Mm. You know what? Come this. here. Just when he watches you and I, I miss the days when you were standing here with me. Come on, bro. Listen to me. Hey, hey, hey. James, you cannot come to my house and tell me how to run my family or how to live my life. This is your wife we're talking about for crying out loud. Use your brains! James, get out of my house. Oh, wait a minute. Are you asking me out of your house? I'm asking you to get out of my house, James. Okay? You might be my friend, but your interference is not welcome here. 
Okay, so please get out of my house. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. I'll leave. Just do as you wish. Thank you, I will. What nonsense. How dare you? How, how dare you try to tell me how to live my life? Like I'm some kid. Like you're feeding me, or what? You come to my house and you want to tell me how to, how to live my life, how to run my home, like I'm some kid? You're feeding me? What the hell? I personally, I can't do anything. Let me say, we we're so close. We were like brothers, good friends. Not until he asked me to leave his house. It was quite embarrassing. Oh, Amanda, at this point, I think I wouldn't want to say anything about this issue anymore. It's okay. It's okay. I understand. I'm sorry I put you through this whole embarrassment. And thank you. Thank you for at least coming through for me. I don't take it for granted. I appreciate it. You're welcome. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, anyway, please take care of yourself, okay? And for Amanda, mm -hmm. please take very good care of her. Do not let anything affect her. Okay. Okay. Thank you. One more thing. Have this, just in case Amanda needs anything. Really? You know you don't have to. Please. It's from my heart. You didn't ask for it, I gave it to you. Please accept it. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Okay, I'll go now. Before. All right. It's not speaking for me. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. All right, that's a little girl. Yeah, sure. You have saved the food, and what are you waiting for? Why? What are you saved waiting for? You want to what? You want to see what? Wait, baby. Hold on, my love. Hold on. I should not poison this food. No. Oh yeah, test it. <laughs> test it. I told you to taste the food. You want to eat everything. <laughs> Monkey. No sense. What do you want, Amanda? I I was only worried about Ada's school. She hasn't paid her school fees and she needs to go back to school. But she can't go back to school because her school fee is, you know, if not, we've not paid for it. You should be able to take care of your own daughter's school fees. Isn't it a shame that you have to ask me for that? Very big shame. Woo! You know I don't work. If 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 I'm working, I should have been able to contribute something, even no matter how little. It's fine. I'll take care of it. Fly now, we're gonna go. My love, um, I'll be needing money for you know my pedicure and other stuff. Okay, that's okay, baby. I'll take care of it. I know you will. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Mm -hmm.
Babe, please massage my my leg properly. I'm trying. I'm just um, surfing through the streets of um, yeah, social media streets, huh? Uh huh. A lot is happening. I mean, people are just going up. Why haven't you paid my school fees? Go this way first. Stay this place. Auntie, come this side first. Come this side. Hand over your hand Look at your head. Sorry, Ada, what are you doing here? Eh? Come. come. Auntie, come here. How come lunch is not ready? Huh? How come it's not ready? I, 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 I pasted the menu list in that kitchen and it's still not ready. I'm just trying to... You're trying to what? What are you... You're always thoughting. What are you thoughting? You're always thoughting. Fly! I'm going to get me lunch. Follow your mother. Follow your mother. I'm going to go to my class. See, I'm beginning. I, I'm getting upset. I'm really, really getting upset. You let yourself get worked up over this this issue. Uh, you're the one who said they can stay. I, I think I'm going to change my mind. You said I wanted them to go to the village. You said they could stay. So uh, why are you? I think this time we have to throw them out to the streets because I, I, I can't take it anymore. What's all this? Please just take it easy, okay? Calm down. Uh -uh. Let me breathe. I need to breathe. Goats, they water, tiny, tiny brats. Amanda, Amanda, I'm obsessed with you. I'm not happy. How could you? How could you degrade yourself because of a man? Huh? How? A, a woman like you doesn't deserve to be treated the way you're being treated. And the worst part of it all is that you're subjecting your daughter to the same pain. Why? What do you have me do? Eh? What should I do? This is my marriage we're talking about here. I can't just get up and walk away from it. The same marriage is for better, for worse. Maybe this is my own worst case. Maybe this is my own bitter part of experience in marriage. So let me just face it. Let me carry my cross. For the love I have for Michael. Let me carry this cross. Because I don't know what else to do. Amanda. Come to me. I am ready to rescue. I don't know, honestly. I don't know. Uh, Amanda, what do you mean you don't know? Your mental health is at stake. And of course, that of your daughter too. If you ask me, I'll suggest you leave. It is better. Nonsense. Did you come here to cry? If you want to cry, take it somewhere else. You say you can even commit suicide if it was. But carry this nonsense out of this place. We're Rubbish. We're Will sorry. you move this nonsense? We're Look, sorry. move this load. Carry this load out of here. Rubbish. Can you imagine? You came here to cry. Don't cry. You do. You just sat down here to cry. I, 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 I. Try me next time. Idiot. Just pollute this 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 whole environment. Where is the remote? Yeah. Uh -uh. Where is the remote? You like it? 
Yeah, very nice. Thank you so yeah, much. A lot of tension in your ankle. Like, super stressed. Don't worry, I got you. I'll take care of you. I'll work okay. it all out today. I... It is obvious you want me out of your house and out of your life. I took a vow with you at the altar, for better, for worse. But that's only applicable if we both are still interested in this marriage. But I see you've made up your mind. I will not degrade myself any further. You have treated me like I have no one to fight for me. I will not fight you, Michael. Do you know why? All I have for you is love. But I will leave and let you enjoy your new life. Amanda, you make it seem as if I have a choice in the matter. I can't control the way I feel and I explained to you that I no longer feel love for you. There's nothing more to say to it than that. So please, take good care of my daughter. Mommy, I thought you said we're traveling. Why are we leaving daddy? My love, we are not leaving daddy. This is only for a while. We are just letting daddy be. Okay? Welcome to your new home. Wow, it's beautiful. You like it? Yes, I like it. You must have spent a fortune on it. Of course, yes. It's worth it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, uh, yeah. thank you for taking care of my daughter and I. Thank I you, sir. It's okay. It's okay. So, uh, feel at home? Okay. Everything you need to make yourself comfortable in this house. Okay. All right. Let me show you to your room. Wow! Thank you so much. What's up, sir? This way. Oh uh, yeah. So let's go this way. What is it? What happened, babe? Can you believe that that fool, James, is responsible for Amanda leaving this house? I knew it! I've always known. I am pretty sure she's dating him. In fact, you need to thank God every day of your life for bringing me into your life. Yes! I made you realize the kind of woman you married! Hmm. By now, both of them would have been planning to kill you. God forbid. God forbid. They ah. can't, they can't touch me. They can never harm me because he that is in me is greater than he that is in them. Amen. No. That that unfortunate James. He's just he's just an opportunist. Mm. Yes, and that my so-called ex-wife. Mm. She's just I mean, she, she's just desperate because she can never get a man like me. Are you sure you're not battered? Because if you are, I'll just pack my things. Oh, come and on, leave. babe. Don't say that. Bothered by what? You know what I mean? If you're, you're bothered, I will leave. I'm not going anywhere. I have you. You are mine. 
and I am yours forever. Okay, all I need to do now is make sure that we're cool. That's my only responsibility now, and I'm happy. Very good. More reason you need to send me more money so I can take care of myself and take care of you as well. My baby, I need to li li live the soft, soft girl life. I, I can't will be take suffering. Care of you. Huh? I will take care of you, I promise. Okay, as a matter of fact. I'm sending money to you right now. Immediately. So you can go and get yourself the things that you need. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Alright? How much do you need? Just tell me. Uh -huh. I got you, babe. Uh -huh. Just tell me. Tell me. Five million, baby. That's not a problem. What's five million? Uh, babe. Really? Uh, baby can just um <clears throat> they can just add up like make it seven million. Uh okay, you know what? Oh. I will give it to you, but let me just give you what I have in my spending accounts now. What do you have? I have money in my... I have money somewhere. Ah. You know? So what do you have here? Let me just... Ah. Let me let me shake. Oh, yeah, shake Let me man. shake something. <laughs> shake, shake it, don't baby. Shake, don't shake. shake it, don't break shake. it. Shake it, don't break it. Shake it. <laughs> Mommy, I don't like this new place. Who is daddy? <laughs> My love, you will see that soon, okay? I want to go back home. I don't like this new place. Sweetheart, you can't go back home now, not just yet. And besides, your new school is here, okay? No. By the time you start school, Mona, I don't want a you new get school. To this place. You like this place, I promise you. You know? This is somewhere I know, go we back should go home. home by next oh. I know. Don't worry, once you start school here, you will get to like it. Mm -mm. Okay? This is to see daddy. Daddy will see you soon. This is somewhere we should call a home. We can, you know, mini home. <clears throat> yes. Abba, mom is right. Okay? Let's see. This is your new home, okay? Mm -hmm. And your school is in the neighborhood. I don't want a new school. You don't want a new school? I promise you, by the time you get to your new school, you're going to love it. Mm -hmm. They have smart kids like you are going to make new friends. Exactly. And they're going to take care of you real mm -hmm. good, okay? You'll learn new things that will change your life for good. Mm -hmm. You're a good girl, right? You mm -hmm. want to be better? Yeah. That's my girl. <laughs> uh, Amanda. Yes. yes. Do not bother, okay? Don't worry. I'll foot the bills, the school fees, and everything in a new school. Alright? You will? Of course, I will. And, uh, Ada, you like pizza, right? Yes. And you like ice cream. Good girl. So, right now, we'll step out and go get ice cream. Yay! <laughs> That's my girl. You love that? That makes you happy? <laughs> yes. A chopped knuckle. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. All right, right. That's my girl. <laughs> so, so you're going now or no, we should just freshen up? Uh, you're good. Oh, we should go now. Okay, 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 of course. Okay, There's a little lady <laughs> thing. She looks good. <laughs> yes. So, okay. shall we? Huh? That's my girl. How did we get here? Tell me what went wrong. Babe, are you okay? What's wrong? What's wrong? Things are not going well at all. Business hasn't been good lately. I haven't gotten any new contracts. Especially since James left. You know, since we parted ways because of Amanda's issue. Wait, are you... 
Are you saying it's my fault? Come on, hell no. Babe, how can I say it's your fault? I'm saying it's James's fault. I mean, I should have always known that that guy was so wicked and, and spiteful of my success. I'm glad you have a real definition for him. That, by the way, I brought this business proposal. Babe, if you look into it, you'll see that it is a very good business venture. We will make a lot of money from this. All you need to do is go through it and you will love it, trust me. Look, babe, I don't think I have money for any ventures right now. You haven't even gone through it and you're condemning it already. My love, I know the taste you have. You have very high taste. So I'm sure that whatever business is here is something I can't afford to invest in right now. Can you just go through it first? Okay? Okay, I'll go through it later, please. All right. It's okay. Everything is going to be fine. I got you. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Of course. No problem. I'll be right there with you guys, okay? I I'm gonna call you back. James. So you told your security people not to let me into your office again? Just the way you brought me from your house. How does it feel now? Bro, you should have told me you were interested in Amanda. Instead of sneaking around my back the way you did. I would have given her to you, willingly. Because you know that I don't want her anymore. What was the need for you to go behind my back? Just tell me. I got myself a woman that makes me happy. A woman that gives me joy, my sweet in the middle. You know that. I would have given Amanda to you. You should be ashamed of yourself. Look at you. You discarded your wife because of my sexual pleasure you're getting from a side chick. I pity your ending. Pity yourself. Because you are the one who just got yourself into a mess. Yes. I made my choice. Okay? I found a woman that that is everything that I've ever wanted in a woman. And I went for her. Now you've made your own choice. I hope you are enjoying Amanda. <laughs> oh, Michael, you're so empty and funny. I thought you said you don't have feelings for her anymore. I don't. So why are you here? Why are you complaining? I only came here to let you know that I know who you are now and what you've been up to. Anyway, I have a meeting to catch up with. I don't have time for this gibberish you're spitting out of your silly mouth. I'm out. You think this is the last of it, James? You think this is the last of it? I will deal with you. I will deal with you myself in my own way. Think this is... Really tired. How was your day? Ah, uh, babe, I'm not gonna lie. I've I've been having a very bad and hectic day. Mm -hmm. But now that I'm home and 
seeing your face, I feel much better already. I know. I know. Join me. Is this what you're eating? Mm-hmm. Is there no food in this house? Because I'm actually very hungry. There's no food in this house, so... Your house make left now, so... There's no food. Babe, are you telling me you can't go into the kitchen and cook for us to eat? What? I should go into the kitchen and cook. Cook what? Please, oh, I'm not here to suffer. I told you this is the baby girl lifestyle for me. I should enter the kitchen so that the heat will kill my skin and, and soil my makeup. I can't do that. Please, I'm not here to suffer, baby. I'm not here to suffer. Let's eat out. Let's go out and eat. Ah, uh, what's that? Mm. If, I, if, I, if, I, if I go and stretch myself now, which stretch will I, will I use tonight? And you know how many rounds we will normally go? Please, don't stress me. That's okay. I'll go and make something for us to eat. You want to cook? Oh. You don't want to eat? I will eat. I will eat. I'm very hungry. I'm very hungry. I'm very, very hungry, I'm very, very hungry my love. Whatever I prepare, you manage it. No problem. Once the food is ready, let me know. Thank you. Mm. <coughs> Let me know when the food is ready, yo. Hey, my beautiful. Look at you. <laughs> Looking so fine. I know. What have you been doing? I'm just um, surfing on the streets of TikTok. TikTok? Mm -hmm. You and your TikTok fans. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. I just wanted us to talk about something like, babe, when are we actually going to go see your parents? Oh, okay. Look. You want us to get married. Mm -hmm. If we're going to get married, I need to see your parents. Babe, I know. But you see, my mom is not feeling so strong. I don't want us going there and she, you see her looking like that. We can't travel all the way there and she's not strong enough. That's what you've been saying. Why don't we just go and let me meet your mom. Let me see her for myself and see how her condition is. Look, if she needs better treatment, we can always take her abroad, fly her somewhere. I'll pay for it. Babe, I know. But she's been taken care of. Are you sure? Babe, just a little bit of patience. Trust me, we're going to see her. And besides, I'm living with you already, so I should be the one worried, not you. <laughs> I want it to be official, okay? I want to know that you are mine mm -hmm. now. And forever. Huh. Wakey, wakey. Hey, babe. Babe. Babe, wake up. Wake up. Mm. Wake up. Babe, I need to go for shopping, okay? I found out that there's no money in my account. So I need some money to go for shopping. Wait. Babe. Yeah? Oh my god, what time is it? It's early. It's morning. What? What? Babe, I had an important meeting to go to two hours ago. Why didn't you wake me up? The alarm did. I mean, I, 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 I felt you wanted to take a day off. Two days off day off. You should have woken me. Come on, babe. My alarm was supposed to wake me up and you didn't wake me no, up. Babe, please don't put it up. Don't, don't you should have woken me up. Don't put it on me, please. <sighs> I've taken your ATM. Please send me the pin. Where are you going? 
What are you going to with my card? Send me the pin! Oh my goodness. I can't believe I missed this, this opportunity again. to do and I don't even have enough money to pay workers or complete these projects. My God. What the hell will she do? What the hell has she done with this kind of money? How did, how did you end up spending all that money? What, the, what, what did you go shopping for that you spent 700,000 naira? How, when I sent you that pin, I told you not to spend more than 100,000 naira from the new card and you ended up spending 700,000 naira. Calm down, you just came in and you're screaming. I, I'm not even good morning, good afternoon, good night. What is it? What, what? I bought what I bought. Look at me, look at the beautiful movies I bought. So beautiful, the color blend is amazing. And they're actually cheap. So I just, this, I think the hairs are like 400k, then I bought jewelry. Can you stop this? What? Have, are, you, are you even paying attention? I've been telling you that we're fast running out of money, babe. And my company is at the verge of collapse and you don't seem to care. You have BPO, calm down. I just bought this hairs. Everything I bought, I, I went for shopping like I told you. It was 700,000, ordinary 700,000. So I don't know why you're screaming, I don't know why you're sure. You're supposed to be happy for me. Look at the beautiful, beautiful hairs I got. And the jewelry, where are they said? I got them, they're so beautiful. And you're like, yes, come, why are you shouting? Do you know I'm a social media influencer? Do you know I am a... Do you know I can... I, I, I would have even gone to Dubai to buy them, but I was like, you know, okay. I, I still have some plugs around. So I don't know why you're screaming. People come to my page, like my fans, they come to my page to look at my outfits, my hairs, and they go buy them. Can you, can you even imagine yourself? Can you, can you, but I've been telling you that my, co my company is collapsing and you, you don't even seem to care. You're not paying attention then to anything. Then fix it! Why are you shouting? Real men go out there and fix their problems. They don't come in and be shouting on their women. What is it? Don't shout at me. Go and fix your problem. What is it? Don't try it. Don't shout at me. Ah, uh -uh. what is it? What do you expect? A social media influencer? I should be dressing tattered? I should be looking tattered? No try and again, no try and. Rubbish. What's all this nonsense? Ordinary 700,000, that's why you're shouting. If I had not used 1 million, what would you have done? Ah, uh ah. -uh. What's this rubbish? Did we get here? Tell me what went wrong. What happened to the love we used hmm. to share? Hmm. All the promises made. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for for spending seven hundred thousand. I don't I trust me. I just wanted to fix my, my nails. I just fixed my nails, bought the wigs and the jewelry. That's all. 
Babe, don't you like them? That's all. It was, I, I didn't mean to hurt you or anything like that. You know, the thing is, I actually have some money in my social media account. Yeah. But the thing is, I'm waiting for them to send me my PayPal code. Then I'll withdraw my money. And you know what? I will just, I'll, I'll, I'll pay back. I'll pay back the 700000 You don't have to stress it. I'm sorry. No, no, no. No, please. It's okay. Um, I mean, you don't, you don't need to, you don't need to refund me or anything like that. Look, it's not as if I, I, I want to shout at you. You know, you're, you're right. You deserve more than that. You mm know, -hmm. it's just that business has been bad. You know, that's what's just getting to me. But not to worry, I'll fix it. You're right. I'll find a way to fix my issues and. Baby. I'll give you everything you want, okay? Okay, why don't you just take a loan? You know? No, no, no. I, I already told you I, I don't do loans. I don't do loans. I started my business from the ground up, from the scratch, and I built it up to where it is today, just with hard work and in, in, in innovation and intuition. So I'm not going to go put myself into some situation that will become a problem for me. I don't do, do I don't do loans. I can't. Okay, fine. You don't do loans. You don't want this. You don't want. Why don't you sell one of your properties? At least fix yourself up, because I, I I'm not going to suffer. You know, I'm not. You know my status. I can't. Come, come, what, 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 what exactly? What exactly is your problem? Problem, by the way I don't have a problem how can you suggest that I sell my properties am I am I supposed to be am I supposed to be going forward am I supposed to be growing or am I supposed to be going backwards so the properties that I've worked so hard to to, to, to buy I should start selling properties why is that why? what you're shouting at me I should sell my properties so that, so that I can fund your habits why, why would you fund your, your spending why would you fund it please what do you mean by no no don't try it don't just try it are you okay no 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 I was on my own I was on my own I'm so tired. Um, do you want me to get you something? Uh, no. Food, water? Don't worry. I'll be fine. So tell me. Do you like the space we just checked? Oh yeah, the space. Yes. It's quite big. I, I was going to ask you if you're trying to open a shopping outlet or something. Oh, as a matter of fact, I intend opening a supermarket there. Oh. Yes. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's a good thing you like it though. Yes, if it's for a supermarket. Mm -hmm. It's perfect. Perfect, right? But yes, it's quite spacious. So all you need to do is just, you know, get your goods in. You know, set it up and you're good to go. Mm. That's good to hear. Mm -hmm. So, I'm good to go. Yeah. Business. <laughs> ah. What is this? What is this? The case of the warehouse. Okay. Yeah. Okay, what you don't know is this. I already paid for the warehouse mm. and also paid for some goods. Okay. Yeah. To set up the supermarket and all is for you. No. Yes. What? Okay. What? I'll explain. I am setting up a supermarket. Yes. For you, Amanda. And guess what? I am going to give you an additional five million. To oh, wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. You you are drawing this to me hot 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 relax i, I need to okay, understand what I'll you're talking about i'll take it again you what you see the space we just checked yes the space has been paid for by me 
and I have bought some goods to stock it up. And I'm giving you additional 5 million to stock it up as well. You know what? On one condition. That you're going to pay me back because that's the only way I will know you're serious with the business. So these are the keys. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You opened the supermarket for me. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, now you have a business to keep you busy. You need it because Ada is now in the boarding school, you know? And this will help quench the trauma. New environment, new friends. Hmm? Yes. Thank you so much. I don't. I don't know how to thank you. <laughs> Call me a, a supermarket. Supermarket owner. Of course you are. Ah! <laughs> thank you. Thank you so it's much. Like, it's okay. Thank you. God will continue to bless you. You see where this money is coming from? The money you're using to take care of me and my child. Oh, your pockets will not run dry. Amen. You, God will continue to increase you Amen. from abundance to abundance. Amen. Levels, higher levels, <laughs> upliftment. Amen. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> God. I am a supermarket. Of course you are. I can't even wait to patronize you by the time you're still selling. Oh, this <laughs> is awesome. Thank you so much. You're God welcome. has used you to bless me. Oh, Thank, yeah. you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate this. Thank you. Oh. What is it? If you don't want to talk, let me leave. Um, please sit down. Sit. Please. <clears throat> Can you look at me? I'm listening now. Just it's... turn and look at me, please. Give me your attention. I have been thinking about the proposal you brought forward. I've come to the realization that it's not a bad idea. Hmm. Yes, I never thought I would ever go into um, car importation as in transport business. It has never been a business I was interested in. So when you brought it up, of course I wasn't I wasn't eager about it. But now having seen the way things are going with my company, it would be foolish of me to continue to reject uh, a business that has the potential of giving me the kind of money that I need to revive my business. So even though I've never been comfortable with taking loans, I do have access to credits and I've decided to take a loan oh. to facilitate the business like you suggested. My baby, baby, come here. Come here. I love you so much, okay? I love you too. You see, it's not like I, I want trouble. I just don't want to suffer. You know, you know I'm here. Just imagine me here and coming down here. Here and here, it, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't... It's okay. It's okay, babe. Yeah. You will not suffer with me. Uh, God forbid. God forbid. That will never happen. Ah. Uh, Alright? Now you're talking. It's because I want the best for you. Listen. Now, now that we have an agreement, I will speak to those guys. They are international car dealers. They will get car at cheaper rates for you. You don't even need to spend so much. All you need to do is send the money and they will get the cars ASAP. Baby, you will make money. And need I remind you that transportation business is the in thing in the country. Okay? That's okay. Like I said, I never thought I was ever going to do that business. But it's fine. It's fine. I, I think I think um I think it'll work out. Don't think I it know, will. I know it will work yeah, out. Yeah, you have to be in you a know, positive mindset. Yes. You have to be positive. 
It's okay. Oh, baby. I don't like us quarreling. Neither you know? do I. Oh, my baby. I don't want you to leave me. Oh, I'm not leaving anywhere. I promise you'll never leave me. How will I leave you? You are my life, baby. You are my all. <laughs> my all. Thank you, I love. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, get some sugar. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for what? Mm. Stop thanking me. Maybe. Baby, these guys are genuine. Trust me. And you say they understand the business very well. Very well. I'm personally, I'm looking at we getting high class SUVs. You know, they just they just concluded the election, so there's a new government in city. So imagine these important dignitaries coming coming in and out of the of the state. So if we have like ten SUVs at the airport, we'll make money, and the rest of the money we can buy like um, Uber and um, cars for Uber and service delivery. Babes, we're gonna make money. Hmm. Trust me. That's an amazing idea. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm smart. Ten. Yeah. 10 SUVs. Okay. Okay. That, uh, as soon as the loan I applied for is approved and the funds hit my account, I'll send the money to those guys. I, I applied for 200 million. I'm sure that should be enough for 10 SUVs. 200 million? Yeah. Wow. That, 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 is, that is good business, you know, but I was looking at, uh, let's say, 300 million. 200 million is fine, baby. Yeah. 200 million. I'm sure we can get some really good classic cars for what that amount. What are you saying, baby? 200 million is perfect. You know what? I need to get you something to chill it because you need to chill your nerves. <laughs> your nerves need to be chilled out. Oh, yeah, I'm baby. coming, baby. <laughs> 200. 200 million, baby. 200 million. It's, it's not my money, baby. You know that, right? It's the bank's money we have to pay back. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Wow. Oh, thank you. Two hundred million. You, you're not drinking? No, I I had a lot earlier, <laughs> babe. We are going to make money. A oh lot, yeah. Lots of it, baby. Baby, I just want to give you the best life. I know. I want you to. I want you to have everything that that you deserve. You <sighs> deserve it, babe. Soft life gang. Mm -hmm. I don't like to suffer. Oh, yeah. And I don't want you to suffer. Oh, no, baby. There's no suffering here. Oh, no suffering God. here, okay? Oh, baby. I'm We're just going to be flexing all day. Oh, my Soft life. My baby. baby. Yes, you are the number one, the champion. No, baby, you are my best sweet in the middle. Oh. Mm. I just touched the button. I know! Oh my goodness! <laughs> baby. What? You know what I want right now? What? You know what I want what right now? What do you want? I want to visit the palace. Mm. Sweet in the middle. Oh, my baby. I cannot wait. Uh, no. Come on, let's go upstairs, baby. Upstairs? Baby, we can have it here. Ooh. Why do we have to have why do I have to have it on the bed? Right here? We can do it anywhere, baby. Uh, let's go there. Let's go, baby. Let's go there, baby. Yeah. <sighs> babe, what's the problem? Why is your face like this? Baby, I'm, I'm, I'm really, really worried. I'm very concerned. When, when is this transportation business going to start? When is it going to start? Babe, it's taking too long. I haven't heard from your guys. Can I talk? What do you want to say? Babe, relax. It's been months since I sent them the money. What is going on? Can you relax? Let me okay, just say fine. something. Okay, listen, I spoke to one of the international dealers and he told me, he told me that everything is in check. That you, you will soon receive your car, so relax. He told you that? Yes. So how come I can't get through to him on the number they gave me? Babe, do you trust me? 
It's not an issue of trust, babe. It is an issue of trust because you, if you trust me, you will believe that you will, you will know that this is true. No, no, babe. It's not an issue of trust. It's a matter of time. Time, okay? It's been too long already since they received the payment and I'm yet to see any movement. There's, there's nothing about the cars. My company is crashing every day. Ever since I lost that money on that deal, I haven't been able to recover. I want this transportation business to start so that I can make money from it to, 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 to inject into my, my business. Well, he told me that everything is as planned. You will get your car, your cars as soon as possible. So I don't want you to worry so much. Just give me the benefit of doubt. Your cars will soon arrive. I got you. Babe. Just a little faith. What, what good news? The only good news I want to hear now is that my cars are ready. Babe, calm down. Well, I spoke to one of the international dealers and he told me that your cars are in Nigeria and one of the dealers is in Nigeria right now. Like right now. Are you Mr. serious? Cars. Yes. My cars are ready? Yes, babe. And one of them is in the country. Uh, why, like, is, why is his number not connecting? The one that you're with his contact was not in the country. That's why he wasn't going through. But your cars are right here in Nigeria. Are you telling me my cars are ready? Yes! And they're already in the country? Yes! Oh my goodness. Are you... <laughs> is this really happening? Yes, it is happening. Baby, yeah. when, when are we going to... When are we going to go it's, get them? It's late. I would have given you the address. But tomorrow morning, maybe you wake up, just go right there. Go, go get dressed. Okay. We need to celebrate. Already? I'm taking you out. Yes. Oh my goodness. Go get dressed. Okay. I heard everything you said. I thought you said you loved me. Of course I love you. You see, dating Michael was a mistake. I was lonely. I was, I was alone. But trust me, I am not going back to him. Boy, I heard everything you said, though. You even gave him a the option of sending his wife away. He was going to destroy me. I mean, if I don't destroy him, he will destroy me. He will keep following me around. I know him very well. I'm not a fool. But trust me, I know exactly what I'm doing. So what do you intend to do? <sighs> Babe. I want to teach him a lesson. I want to gather enough money so we can start life afresh. You know, travel out of this country. I need you to understand me. I need to know that you are with me on this. Are you sure this is going to work? <laughs> Trust me, I got this. Why are you looking like that? Did you see a ghost? What are you doing here? What am I doing here? I've been calling you for... Rich. I've been calling for about a week and you're not taking my calls. It is risky for you to be here for my own good now. You can't be here. <gasps> hey, look, I miss you now. You have to go. You have to go. Okay, calm down. Um, how's the plan going? 
it's fine. He signed the papers last week with the guys we set him up with. And I mm. can't just leave him until everything is calm. Everything is just fine. If I leave him now, he will start suspecting it and he will look for information about us. So we need to just calm down. I got this. Relax. Ha! Huh. Hey, I trust you. Okay? Okay, okay. I'll leave. I'll leave. What? Hey, I'll see you next week, okay? <laughs> Get out! Get out! Get out! address you gave me is there's nothing there is an empty garage I've been duped This house would definitely be taken over by the bank. I have only three months to pay back the loan. Where on earth am I going to get 200 million naira from? Everything I have worked for is going down. I'm losing it all.
I don't understand. Okay, I don't understand. Okay, now your post stop be this now. Now, where you say to go? Is this because I asked you to drop me? Ah. Is it here? Now, the post stop be this now. See, now, see, I'm going to streets. Take. What's in be this? Have your money. Not the, I, okay, I will which one be this one. Now, this is 50 naira. Now, your money is 100 naira. Okay, that is the money because this drop me where I asked you to drop me. Okay, your money is 100 naira. Not only you are carrying, how on carry you enter streets? Why? When are they go like this? See other passenger. You get luck a day in my good mood today. I've got call boys for here. Uh, okay, your money now, hundred now. Give me my money. I touch beg. me now. To no, touch me. If you get my touch me. Move. Okay, give me my money now. Okay, your money now, hundred now. Give me my money now. Which one be this one? No, it be man, eh? It be my fellow man. If you no say you leave man, touch me. Mugu. You get luck, say by day my good mood today. I've just call guys who will beat you up here. They like you can see this one. You know five better thing we go do to help your life, Mugu. No, touch me now. Best my use back and give you. This is not funny at all. I've not met my target for the week, and this man will not hear any excuses this time around. If not, he will just take the keke away from me. Where the worst matter? No, 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 Carry this week, they are not normal at all. Somebody cannot even eat good food. I just pray that fuel will be enough for me to run this morning trip so I can make some more money to deliver to the owner. following me what is it please please just hear me out i've been looking everywhere for you really you're a married man why are you looking everywhere for me what is the pro what is it I'm, I'm really really sorry i need us to talk talk about what please hear me no out. what do you want to talk about listen whatever your name is by the time i reach that next junction i don't want to see you following me 
there are policemen there. I'm going to report you as a thief. So if you love your freedom, you stop following me. Okay? Be guided. Babe. Do not. Don't. Please, can, can we just talk? Can you just give me some, just a little time? Amanda, I'm really sorry about everything, Amanda. When he watches you and I, I miss the days when you were standing. What does he want? Do I know? And I don't care. What? Can you imagine? It, I am sorry. He is sorry? After all these months, that's all he had to say to me. I am sorry? Oh well. I knew it. I knew it was going to come someday. But I never knew. It will be this early. And from the way you described him, I'm very sure Kamal's caught up with him. I don't care. I don't care whatever Kamal wants to do with him. You should just take him. I don't I don't care. It's none of my business. You see this life I'm living now, right? This peaceful life of mine. I don't want anybody to interrupt it for me. Not even Michael. I don't want it. I am happy the way I am. So let him stay where he is. It's okay. It's all right. Just calm down. You know, um, we don't even know what he wants. And we can't jump into conclusion. What else would he want? What else? You see, I don't, I don't want to see him. You don't get it. I don't want to set my eyes on him at all. I don't want to be around him. That man caused me so much pain. No. No. Amanda, please don't stress yourself out with this, okay? I'm here for you. And your little princess too. Everything will be fine. Do I even explain this? Isn't it obvious she's having an affair with James? Because that's the only explanation for what I just saw today. She's obviously living a good life. With a car on top of it. I just have to erase that thoughts and mindset of having her back. Because she's no longer in my class, obviously. She now lives a better life than me. And there's no way I can subject her to this low-class life I'm living right now. I just have to ask for her forgiveness. I really miss my daughter. I miss my family. Oh God. This karma. This karma.
around the door. I'll be right there, okay? doing in my house uninvited. My man, I didn't come to fight. I came because I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I want my wife back. What did you just say? Did I hear you say you want your wife back? My girl. You lost it. You lost everything. The moment you divide your family and choose another woman. I made a mistake. And I'm paying for it. Please. I just want forgiveness. I want her forgiveness. Just, just look at you. Look at you. You, you see? Karma. Karma is a sweet experience for people like you who've heard. Tell me, how do you feel when you treat people the way you like without considering if reverse is the case? How? Hey, anyway, I'm not Amanda. So why don't even stand in the position to ask her to forgive you? She might anyway. I don't know. I don't know when. Michael, till then, please turn around and get out of my house. Bro, look at me. I'm a broken man. I've, I've learned my lesson. I'm going to change things. Please talk to her for me. That's none of my business. Get out of my house right now! Bro, please. Can you just talk to out? me? Out! Michael, get out of my house! Right now! Out! Why now? Why is he looking for me everywhere? Why? After leaving me broken all this while, why is he looking for me? Why? I mean, why me? Why me? Why? 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 Amanda, calm down. Just take it easy. I don't want you to stress yourself out with this, okay? I pity him anyway. He got what he deserves. Oh, weren't you there? Did you not see what he did to me? Yes, he got what he deserves. Let him suffer. You have to forgive him. Please, Amanda. I have thought about this over and over again. And I will suggest you forgive him, okay? You have to, in that way, you forget all the pains it cost you. Everything. See, you've been coming here for over a week now. Just speak to him so he'll stop budging into you. James, I don't want to see him. I don't want to set my eyes on him. I don't want to have any conversation ever with him. I don't want it. What? What is it now? He has a wife. Let him go to her. Oh, wh wh where is he coming for me? All of a sudden. 
I am now what? His wife? No! Let him go and marry his wife. Let him marry. Happy marriage! I know you're saying all those things because you're still upset. You think? Uh, I'm not happy with him either. But look at him. Michael is drowning. <laughs> Though he will not be held responsible for what happens to him. But I tell you what. If anything happens to him, your conscience will never forgive you. Let him drown. Let Michael drown. In fact, let the ground open and swallow him. Yes. Let him suffer. He deserves it. He worked for it. So let him reap. Let him reap. But wait a minute. You're going on and on advocating for him, pleading on his behalf. I thought you loved me. What all of that that you did for me. I, I care about you. Yes. And I care about him too. The truth is, I care about both of you. And this is for your own good. Everything we built together. This is this is it. But you lost everything because of a woman. Because of mere pleasure, Michael. And, and this is where you ended up. This. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for everything. I really am sorry. Words are not enough to express how sorry I am. She, she broke me down. She took everything. <laughs> Amanda. <laughs> no, no, please listen to me. This is not why we're here. Look at him. It's obvious you are the only woman who can bring him back to what he used to be. Please forgive him. Please, that's the reason we're here, please. I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry for everything. And I promise you, we'll do everything. Do everything within my power to make up for my mistake. Please forgive me. Oh well, I've forgiven you. Okay, I've... you know why you did all that you did is what I don't understand. Why you treated me the way that you did is what I cannot comprehend. It was a mistake. It was a mistake. Please. Well, like I said, I'm forgiving you. But I don't know. I don't know how you intend to mend all the broken ties. All the trust. I don't know. I don't know. So. That's what happened. That's how she convinced me to invest in that 
stupid transportation business idea she came up with introducing me to those men who promised they were going to supply us cars at ridiculous discounts I was supposed to use that to set up the business and ferry dignitaries from the airport to their destinations and other services she convinced me I took a loan and they defrauded me so about your business the company the company was not doing well after you left I was bleeding money, bro. I was bleeding money left, right, center. And Bella wasn't helping in any way. She was just excessively demanding, spending recklessly, making me feel like I wasn't man enough for her. And I tried to meet up. I was trying my best to, to make her happy. So after all that you did for her, she still defrauded you, jilted you, and has come there with her boyfriend. Was that it? Yeah. Oh, my girl. Michael, how could you? Sorry to say, but you are the biggest fool I've ever known in my life. Yeah. You're right. You're right. I deserve that. You know, I thought you and Amanda were dating. I'm not like you. I'm not. I have never been interested in Amanda. From the onset. God knows. I have never. And I have never thought of taking advantage of the situation on the ground. You see, I decided to come in after you and your concubine served Amanda and your daughter, Ada, with a huge amount of humiliations in your house. All that you've done, you think just serious emotional trauma to your wife but also it caused a serious psychological trauma to your daughter can I get you back to your senses anyway You're welcome. You see, everything I did, everything I did from the onset is just to make you jealous. I thought you'd be jealous because I'm getting closer to your wife. So you come back to her, but no, you didn't. Michael, in as much as I'm disappointed in you, I'm happy that you regained your senses. I can never repay you for your kindness, James. But I want you to know that I'm forever indebted to you. I 
just want to tell you how grateful I am that you chose to forgive me and to give us another chance. Michael, I've forgiven you. But you see, to get back to where we were, it would take time. It would take a whole lot of work as well. Ada and I really missed you, you know. I just... I'm just happy. I'm, I'm happy we... We get to be a family again. But you know... We still have unresolved issues. And I am thinking we should see a sex therapist to help us resolve our intimacy issues. Okay? But before that, we have to renew our vows. Yes, because I want you to choose me all over again. All over again. I choose you, baby. I choose you every day, forever. Okay. <laughs> so we will do everything you have said. I agree. All right. But man, this place, nah. It's not gonna work for me. We will have to, you know, figure it out. You have to get out of here. <laughs> Thank you so much, my love. Don't ever break my heart again. <laughs> How did you do it? James, how? how what, what happened? How, how did it happen? How did they get arrested? Because they were still in the country. They never left. You know, they made you believe they left the country already, but no, they didn't. They were having difficulties processing their visa. Wow. So they're in police custody now? Mm -hmm. And they'll pay for everything? Of course. The accounts are frozen and the police will recover everything. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. So, I'm so happy. Now I can have some peace. Yeah. And lesson learned too. Lesson learned. <laughs> lesson learned. <laughs> I should go to the police station. Are you, are you coming? Uh, of course. Let me just pick up something from the office okay. okay you meet me there sure thank you so much right now I'll meet you there okay thank you thank you thank you so much james how did we get here tell me what